In this video, I will show how to install Windows 11 on VirtualBox in Ubuntu or Linux. Let's get started. At first, download Windows 11 ISO file and install VirtualBox on your system. Okay. Now create a new virtual machine. Okay, enter the name and operating system Windows 11. Okay, now select operating system type and version. Okay, now click on next. Select the memory size, minimum memory will be 4 GB that is equal to 4096 megabyte click on next now create a virtual hard disk create select virtual box disk image and then click on next select dynamically allocated click on next okay minimum storage size will be 64 gb okay now click on create now open settings and do the following click on system then motherboard and enter base memory size 4 GB minimum and this will be the boot order floppy optical then hard disk okay now select ship chat PIIX3 and extended features enable IO APIC and enable EFI. Then click on processor tab. Okay. The minimum number of CPU will be 2. Okay. Maximize the execution cap and enable PAE. Okay. Now click on display and maximize the video memory okay and select graphics controller vbox svga and enable 3d acceleration now maximize video memory okay 256 megabyte okay now click on storage and then empty and then click on this disk icon and choose a disk file select windows 11 iso file and open now click on ok start virtual machine ok press any key from your keyboard Okay, select language to install and time and currency format and keyboard or input method. Then click on next. Now press shift and F10 at the same time to launch CMD. And now type REG edit. Hit enter. This will launch registry editor okay now click on hotkey local machine and then click on system and right click on setup okay create new key and enter the name of this key lab config okay now right click on lab config and then create a key D word 32 bit value okay enter the value of this key bypass TPM check okay modify and 
enter the value 1 ok now right click on lab config again and do the same enter the key value name bypass ram check ok modify and enter value data 1 bypass secure boot check ok now modify enter value data 1 ok now close registry editor and type exit in command prompt ok now click on install now click on i don't have a product key and select operating system you want to install then click on next now accept the microsoft software license terms ok click on next then click on custom install ok now create a partition click on new and then apply click on ok now format this partition ok and select and then click on next and this will take a while windows 11 installed now services are starting ok now select the region or country click on yes now select the right keyboard layout or input method you can skip now system is checking for updates ok let's name your device enter a name ok now click on next
wait just a moment how would you like to set up this device you can set up for personal use or set up for work or school set up for personal use then click on next let's add your microsoft account if you have okay if you don't have an microsoft account and if you want to use as a local user click on sign in option and then click on offline account okay now click on skip now okay now enter your username okay now click on next and enter your system password confirm password same password type again click on next and now add the security question okay choose privacy settings for your device okay choose your settings and then select accept okay checking for updates this will take a while hi all things is done okay the windows is ready for you almost there okay now enjoy windows 11 in ubuntu or linux if you like this video give a like for this video comment and share thank you so much for watching this video